and here we have pause. This mutes the audio there if you click that button and that takes you full screen or you then get all these options at the top and on the side. Very nice. So today we're back to our more regularly scheduled programming of course a new smart home security camera this is the easy viz this is the easy viz c3n this is a 1080p outdoor camera that also works with alexa and google assistant so uh it has a nice aluminum alloy shell that is great for protection for outdoors and you can plug this up connect it to your wi-fi and have you a full hd 1080p camera up in no time so special thanks to this company for sending it to me we're of course going to get on the overhead rig we'll go through the unboxing of this camera then we'll download the app go through the setup process and even show you some video clips directly from this camera so click like click subscribe indulge in your life at indulgeclothing.com for the merch and now let's check out the easy viz c3n outdoor security camera all right so this is the easy viz c3n 1080p outdoor smart wi-fi camera as you can see it works with alexa and google the uh, top here just has some specs you get live view audio instant alerts video history up to an eight time zoom and it's smart home enabled it has human detection color night vision h265 video technology full hd 1080p wi-fi 2.4 gigahertz dual external antennas it has a micro sd card slot for local storage up to 256 gigs and it also has optional cloud storage and it is ip67 weatherproof and dustproof this side talks about some of the features. So upon detection of intruders, the camera will flash two spotlights to scare them off. So it has two built-in spotlights. The aluminum alloy shell design pro provides better protection. With a whole metallic enclosure and an IP67 rating, the camera is weatherproof and dustproof. And it is a 360 degree swivel base for easy installation on the wall or ceiling. And then uh, this is just kind of some of the specs and company information. And then uh, just the sticker there and company logo there. So let's open this on up, see what we're working with here. Plastic off. And how does this open? Let's see. Is this a sleeve? Maybe it does slide out of this. Yeah, it looks like it does. Is there any tape anywhere? There it goes. All right. Now we have uh, the same information on another box. All right, C3N outdoor smart Wi-Fi camera, right on top, I like that little picture. So a quick start guide is right on top, and then uh, you can scan this QR code to get their app. So it's user's manual. Then what do we have over here? Some foam, this seems to be. The power adapter, so just a standard uh, power adapter to power the device. These are some connectors to help make the connection weatherproof. And then uh, got a drill template so you know where to drill your holes. And uh, screws, of course, those are helpful. And that's it for the box. So this is the camera itself. Very nice. You can feel the uh, aluminum design. It has some real weight to it those off so these are the two external antennas that it was talking about and then this is the 360 degree rotating mount you're just able to put your three screws in and this thing is mounted now also ran through here is your power cable so considering this is a wi-fi camera it can be powered over ethernet with a poe adapter or the dc 12 volt plug which is right here so if you have PoE, you could just pull down your old camera and plug this one in and it would get power and then it would still use these Wi-Fi antennas to talk to your wireless network. I do like the green around it. That's I just like that myself. Underneath this is a reset button as well as a micro SD card slot. And outside of that, there's not a lot more to show you here. So we're going to clean this up. We're going to grab our phone. We're going to get this plugged in and then we'll go through the setup process with you. So we're going to do our power cable. I'd say it's about a five foot power cable. And then we'll plug this end in right here and then this end to our drop cord. Plug this in and the camera should boot up. Yeah, see our little red light there? All right, so the camera is booting. While the camera is powering on, we will unlock our phone. 
go to our camera, scan the QR code, and this is the app we need. So we'll select install. Once the app installs, we'll then create us an account, go through the setup process with our account, which you'll just make use your email and password or phone number and password. And then we'll come back and show you how to add the camera. All right, so we are in the app now. So now we'll just wanna add the device. So we'll select add device. It asks us what kind of device we wanna have. I have a lot of uh, options here. We'll pick cameras. And now it wants us to scan the QR code on the camera. So we got a blue flashing light here. Make sure you can see that and there's a little qr code down here so we will scan that qr code with the camera now it knows what kind of camera we have so we'll say the device is powered on and we'll pick next all right complete the wi-fi setup we'll start that is the indicator flashing blue it is so we'll select next yeah sure while using the app and now it wants our wi-fi ssid and password so i'll type that in or you can pick select and it shows you what's near so there's our Wi-Fi SSID, and then I'll just type in the password. So as soon as I typed in my Wi-Fi password, it wants to connect to the access point device that this camera is giving off. So we will allow it to connect. And basically what that'll do is make my phone connect to the Wi-Fi on the camera to then give the camera the SSID and password that I typed in so the camera can connect to my Wi-Fi. If you have any issues with this, try turning off your mobile data. I have seen that work many, many times in the past. And so there we go. It has did what it needed to do. Now we can give it a name, which we'll just call it the C3N. And uh, we're gonna say it's in the backyard. And there we go. So the audio is off by default. So we'll turn that on. And uh, daylight savings time, time zone, etc. Don't really care for a free trial of the cloud. So we'll select next. And now it wants us to put in a password. So we'll put in a good password here. All right, so this is essentially what the app looks like. So we can select here to select go here. To go here. So uh, turn that down. Now here's where all your cloud storage information would be. I, of course, am not going to do that. Now we can take a snapshot, it looks like. So that does take a photo. And if we click this button down here, it should start recording. So we're recording now. This is a daytime audio video test on the C3W outdoor camera. And then uh, we tap that again and recording saved to album. If we click on the screen here, that's where we have volume and buttons to make the screen bigger. And of course, if you click on this little gear in the top, this is where you get all of your real settings. So uh, I'll turn the audio on again. Night vision mode, color night vision, black and white, smart night vision. Adjust the brightness as well on the same little screen. Daylight saving time, Wi-Fi, storage status, image encryption. You can flip the image. Sleep mode, offline notification. That's always helpful. If the camera goes offline, it'll tell you. And then delete device. Not a lot of options, how I think it should be to make things a little easier. And then here we have pause. This mutes the audio there if you click that button and that takes you full screen or you then get all these options at the top and on the side very nice shockingly this one does not seem to have a uh, speaker so you can't talk to it if you click the alarm button that's the alarm makes it flash pretty cool and that should really do it for the easy viz c3n outdoor security camera at the end of the day a really nice outdoor security camera as i mentioned it does not have a speaker but in terms of audio video quality it gives you a great audio video picture to record either outdoors or indoors plus having the bonus of being able to use poe is a great option if you already have cameras around your house so i'll of course have one of these linked down below in my description if you'd like to grab the easy viz c3n outdoor security camera for your household and that should do it for today's video thank you all for watching click a like click subscribe indulge in your life at indulgeclothing.com for the merch and we'll see you in the next video deuces